seemed like we were just lost amongst all these other bands, you know, trying to do the same thing. Yeah, I, I was um, born in Los Angeles, and then uh, that's where the band sort of, you know, everybody met, and uh, we were in kind of different bands, and then it wasn't until we moved to Los Angeles when we were about 18 and 19 years old. And what, then, you, you know, we're all originally from Bakersfield, though. What kind of area is it, actually? It's, you know, more or less, you know, I think uh, middle class, you know, working class people. Um, and it's just sort of a small town, you know. Do you sometimes, do you still go there often or is it? Yeah, we've been like back. That? We've been back there uh, quite a few times because we were, you know, with the title of the record, uh, remember who you are sort of brought us back to literally you know thinking about where we came from and sort of the, the different uh, obstacles that we were up against you know like coming from a small town you know and you know we, we've gone back and uh, we did our video there oil Dell we did our photo shoot for the inside of the uh, album cover and uh, we've been maybe doing some um, recording also in the future there. What, what, what did you rediscover when going back there? Do you have good memories of it? Is it what, yeah, it was kind of, you know, my, my, you know, for me it was kind of, it was kind of like, uh, it's kind of bittersweet because, uh, you know, both of my parents have passed away now and it's kind of hard, you know, but at the same time it has, a, I had a sense of accomplishment, like, you know, I felt good on the path that we're on with our career, but at the same time, it had sort of a sad feeling because I miss my mom and dad a lot. You know, was it a recent that they passed away? Or? Yeah, only only a couple of years. My father passed away, and uh, my mom maybe four or five years ago. So. And they they lived there. They lived there. Yeah, we had you know the whole family, and you know my brother and sister, and my mom and dad, and we lived there for I don't know 15, 16 years. So. I know the area really well. A lot of childhood memories there. How, how was it then for you to maybe drive past your your old house? Yeah, I actually stopped at my old house and, and uh, took a photo of it. And it's just a small, modest home, and it, it was strange. It was, it's you know, the the street seemed it seemed so big when you're a kid, you know, and then you go back and it's like everything's so small and the streets are really little and uh, used to go to this uh, rail, this railway where we'd hang out under the bridge and uh, drink and, and smoke. Experiment, and, teen experiment. Yeah, experiment with, you know, yeah. and then, you know, the train would come by and we'd throw rocks at the train and just, just stupid shit like this, you know. What for you, yeah, in hindsight, you mentioned in, in interviews before that you sort of got lucky that you had the chance to, to go away there. Do you have maybe still friends there or may, that, that still live there in, in a way maybe? Yeah, I have a few friends that, that still live there. And uh, I see them when, I, when we go there. When I go there, I'll call them up and hang out. And it's nice to see them. And, you know, some things don't change. And, and those, those friends, those lifelong friends that I'd still keep in contact with, there's maybe three or four of them. Yeah, because it was, was uh, yeah. In hindsight, is it is it like, had a, a bigger influence maybe than you expected on on your further career after that? I think it had, you know, uh, uh, and the influence. I sort of sort of was like an obstacle. It seemed like oh, we're gonna have to try extra hard to sort of overcome and get out of this uh, small town moved to LA and then it seemed like we were just lost amongst all these other bands, you know, mm -hmm. trying to do the same thing. Did you then have maybe an agreement with each other for a certain time that you would like to try it and see well, if it would work? Or, and then had well, I, th I think it was sort of like, like with Fieldy and I, it was like, it was, we're in this to the very end, like however far it goes, you know. No turning back. Actually. No turning back and we'll never take no for an answer, you know? And uh, we're gonna do things our way, and we always had this, you know, sort of this focus of, 
um, never turning back. And, and we're going to, you know, play music at any level, you know, wherever it might be. And uh, that's that's all we know how to do, you know. That's the way it went. Uh, that's the way it still is. Yeah, you know, that's kind of cool.